Hello everybody and welcome back to The Witcher. I'm Grandmaster Grump and this is part three. So far we've, uh, well, we've defeated one monster, we've kicked a bit of ass and found Yennefer and now we're at this big castle where we have to get dressed in one of these outfits and continue the story. So guys, without further ado, let's crack on. Right, so I got to, uh, <laughs> it still says loot though. We've got to pick one of these. I think they all look pretty much the same, but I quite like that. That one will do. Uh, yeah, that would do. It'll be fine. Okay, cool. So. This might come as news to the gentleman. But yeah. a towel wrapped around one's waist is not fitting attire for an audience. Uh, you're gentleman making me get dressed. Fine, whatever. Uh, character, I think. I don't know. Uh, let's see. I've got to go through all this stuff. No, this is... Oh, here we go. Leather jacket. Do I... So, that's just crafting. Alright, oh, I see. Okay, let's put this on then, shall we? And the boots. I wonder if I could put the towel on when they get in there. That would be quite funny, actually, wouldn't it? Cool. Upgrade. Okay. Can only fit this item has matching current unused slot. Well, what slot do I need to put it in? Uh, trophy. I don't care about the trophy. This isn't what's on the horse, isn't it? Oh, okay, fair enough. All right, fair enough. Let's, uh... Is that better? Yes. He likes black that. suits the gentleman. Does They're all the bloody black. satisfy the gentleman? No. Yeah, I suppose so. A studded doublet and a sword on my back. That's what would satisfy me. <laughs> yeah, exactly. But tough. When in Nilfgaard. Yes. Yes. It's a saying. So what now? Out of my nose. No need. The gentleman's complexion is light enough. <laughs> the gentleman is to stand Can't before get a the tan. ruler of the north and south. I must confirm that he knows how to bow. Oh, for fuck's sake, really, you numpty. I can bow. I know how to bow. I'm not some boar. I know how to bow. Shit. Please, demonstrate. Okay, yeah. There we go. That, That'll sir, do. is how you might bow to a whore on a street corner. <laughs> Not to the Emperor of Nilfgaard. Ooh. Please watch. Leg extended. <sighs> hand flat. Head down. Chin to chest. The gentleman will rehearse. It's a dab, isn't it? Okay, so... Uh, what was it? Uh, something... Left hand on chest. No, right hand on chest. Like that. Hmm. Lacking fluidity <laughs> and grace. Basically, but it's a, a downward dab. I think that's a yoga move. Come with me. All right, okay. All right, sorry. Just having my morning coffee, guys. The gentleman right. will address the emperor only uh, when asked to. What? And using the appropriate title. Your arch magnificency. I see the gentleman is in the mood yeah. for chests. Mm. I fear the Emperor might not share his disposition. Your Majesty okay. will suffice. Spoken okay, loudly, clearly, and with respect. Sure, sure, sure. Whatever, dude. Oh, look at him. He's got his little gang. In Grimmy at Art Ketzer. Dyfen Aden in Karn eb Marvut. Emir Var Emreis. Jeez. Bow. All that pompous shit. Ah, uh, bow. Go on then. Might as well. Hmm. Your Imperial Majesty. Arer ep do orde. Avelian namen vat gern favort. Wonder if he speaks my language. We'll see soon. See, won't we? Ah, 
I I probably does then. Bowed before no man. Didn't want to disappoint the Chamberlain. We're friends. <laughs> oh, does he know him? Take it you didn't summon me to reminisce about the good old days. So silence. My daughter Cyrilla. Mm. She's returned. And she's in danger. The wild hunt pursues her. You will find her and bring her to me. Ah, uh, why me? How many men in your army? Twenty thousand? Exactly. Thirty? So why me? You know why. Because she trusts you. She trusts me, yes. So tell me why you're looking for her. Doubt it's about making up for all those lost years. Yeah, for reasons exactly. of state, as always. Enough to marry band, her off, I bet. You will agree regardless. If for no other reason than because I shall pay you. Oh. Than you customarily receive for a contract. Considerably more. That sounds like Charles Dance. I wonder if they've got him. I'm going to have to look this up because... I wonder if they've got a few famous people to voice these guys. Uh, need information. I need information, not motivation. Siri leaves few tracks. Should yeah. be hard to find. My oh, chorus she's the girl we were training at the start, of course. And my army, Go. Should the need arise. You Takes me a while to get there, but I do get there. This audience is finished. Meredith! All right, mate. Calm down. Take him to the sorceress. Ah, oh, what? Really? I don't want to go and talk to a sorceress. just want to get on with the job. <coughs> right. <clears throat> Dun dun dun. So we've got to go and find Follow this uh, Siri. Please keep close. Can there I talk to him? What? To the palace, <laughs> whom the gentleman what? Need not bother. Need not bother. Can't run. Oh. And it's past greeting. Come, you. What? Do you know who you're talking to, soldier? <laughs> Do you know who you're talking to? Yeah. Right, so... I wonder what this sorceress is going to do for us. Um, give us some training, perhaps, or some potions. Hopefully it'll be something useful. Oh, probably, it's probably Yennefer, isn't it? Oh, I forgot, yeah, she is the sorceress. It's so large. Like, this world is so massive, and... With all the books and everything, it's just absolutely insane. I just forget things that I've read from years ago or, you know, watched on the series. What are we doing? Once the gentleman is done, he should see me to retrieve his possessions. Okay, fine. Yes. Be so kind. True authority in Novigrad. Can I just run there? Yeah, we can. All right, let's go and talk to Yennefer. Geralt, that tunic. You look positively smashing. <sighs> Dying to take it off. I'd consider that a proposition under different circumstances. <laughs> you dirty One I might snake. even take you up on. But we've matters to attend to. Okay. Now do you understand why I'm at Amir's court? Mm-hmm. And seems we're in the same boat now. Yep. Siri, she's really back? No chance he's mistaken? Look, that's more mm. or less what she looks like now. Or so our agents claim. Oh, our she's, little witch uh, has grown or into a, a good young lady. Ah, so they're our agents now, hmm. are they? So they're our agents mm. now? My, my. You've clearly settled in quick. My, my. Geralt, don't twist my words. I know who Amir is. He started this war and its mm. bloodshed. He had my friends killed. But I haven't any other choice. So please... Let's not belabor the pros and cons, okay. but instead focus on finding Siri. Yeah. All right? Agreed. Right. Amir said the wild hunts after her. I'd find that hard to believe before what happened yesterday. How did they track us down? Because of me. <sighs> what have you, you see, done? I've spent months searching for Siri, using locating spells, haruspicy, geomancy, anything, really. I knew the wild hunt might sense it. Perhaps even find me, but I thought I'd trick them. Nope, well, you didn't. Guess you were wrong. Hmm. 
I've sensed them on my trail, hunting me, for some time. If not for you and Amir's soldiers, they'd have gotten what they were after. I can't risk another encounter like that. It's time to put away the magic, turn to more traditional methods. To the best tracker I know. Who's that? You must find her, Geralt, Oh, me? Oh, okay, before cool. Before the wild hunt does. I'll have a go. Can't promise anything, though. Uh, yeah, so where's, so where's Siri been seen? Yeah, where's exactly? she been seen? In two places. Velen and Novigrad. The trail in Velen is most promising. You should make that your first stop. Ask for a merchant named Hendrik at the inn at the crossroads. One of the Emperor's right. agents. He should get in touch with you. Okay. That's it. No passwords, secret handshakes. <laughs> None. Sorry to spoil your fun. Your boyhood fantasies about the crafts of the trade. All we have in Novigrad are unconformed reports, rumors. But there you will have the help of our mutual acquaintance. Triss Merigold. Apparently she's got a cozy flat on the main square. Sure she'll be delighted to see me. What about you? What mm. will you do? I shall sail for Skellige. There was a magic explosion there recently, blew half a forest down. I believe this had something to do with Ciri. I'll be in care trolled. Join me there once you've learned something. Okie doke. Uh, why did you contact me? One thing Let's before have a bit we of a go. Chat. Why didn't you contact me? Didn't need me? Didn't even want to see me? I All didn't right, want mate. to spoil God, things. That's a bit, uh... I'd heard you and Triss made a great couple. Yen, I'd lost my memory. Throwing a bit of a tantrum, was he? That's your excuse? Mm. Let's drop it, alright? It's not yeah. what you think, or it helped me understand how much I love you. I don't wish <laughs> to hear it. Any of it. Right, let's get going. Guess this means we need to split up again. Not my preference, but I understand. Clock's ticking. It is indeed. God, he's, he's got real attachment so why don't issues, I hasn't he? To Velen, get you there at once. Not gonna happen. Why I'll not? I'll go on horseback as soon as I can get changed. Have it your way. Oh, and oh no, I wanted you really to be teleported. Look quite dashing in black velvet. Think so? Uh, Maybe I can have some of my armor lined with it. <laughs> Good luck, Yen. Uh, Maybe I can craft myself some black armor. And if you wish to learn what happened in the world while you and Vesemir roamed the wilderness, talk to Ambassador Vartra. That's him over there. And Geralt, all right. I know it's wartime, but try not to be a hero, all right? Just check those leads and come back to me in one piece. Oh, better love. I shall be waiting. Cool. Okay, so let's go and talk to this dude. Uh, where are we going? Bloody hell. Can I come with you? I'm going to try and go with her. Oh, bollocks. That didn't work, did it? Right, okay. Let's go and talk to uh, this guy. What are you drawing? What are you writing, are you? Ambassador Varatra. Yennefer suggested I ask you about current events. The war and so on. Of course. Yes. The Emperor's servants should keep no secrets from each other. If you will, let us approach the map. Ah, the map. Okay. Uh, situation in Velen. Mm. How do things look in Velen? As bad as ever. Perhaps worse. This land never flowed with milk and honey, and now it flows with blood. Oh. Armies have swept through it several times, trampling fields, looting granaries, burning villages. Well, there's nothing left there, then, is there? Grips the populace. Yeah, I was going to say. Mm. So how's ruling that earthly paradise going for you? Not well, to be honest. Our forces are spread thin as it is, and Velen is chiefly swampy forests that are difficult to control. We've had several patrols never return to their camps. Thus, mm. we've temporarily delegated authority in this region to a certain Nordling, a former low-ranking officer in the Temerian army, one Philip Strenger, better known okay. by his nom de guerre, the Bloody Baron. I advise you well, avoid him. Nah. 
going to go and slaughter him. Okay, so let's have a look Any at the situation there. Any news from Is situation the free city there? still free? Yes, although everyone knows this won't last. Radovid oh. is in Oxenford, and the Emperor is here in Vizima, at Novigrad's doorstep both. And both require coin and ships, and Novigrad mm. can provide these. Which is why the mood in the city is rather, well, on edge. Meaning? How do men deal with fear? They seek reassurance oh, and okay. scapegoats. So it's the not another great Eternal place to go to, is it? This perfectly. And so but it promises we'll probably to end up going the to both. Its flock by pointing out the guilty. Who started the war? Who profits from it? Why, it's obvious. Mages, elves, dwarves, mm. in a word, any and all deviants. Mm. I've been stationed in Novigrad for 13 years. First as a consul, then as ambassador. I've seen a great deal. Cruelty, cynicism, greed. But what is happening there now concerns me greatly. Wow. So none of those other things concerned you. Right, let's, uh, what's going on with the war? How's the war going? I mean, apart from the fact that Nilfgaard's triumph is imminent. I assume this to be a private conversation. We've no witnesses, he, he, so let's dispense with the propaganda. He trusts him already, doesn't he? That shrouded in irony. Our offensive was going splendidly until winter came. Oh. Edern was in such disarray that we encountered no resistance. We had reached the Pontar before the first snows. Only a weakened Kedwin remained, and Radovid's Redania, which had ignored the rest of the North's pleas for help. Hmm. We thought they'd sue for peace, perhaps even submit to vassalization. We waited for spring, certain of victory. Okay. Radovid, submit. <laughs> yes, a vain hope, I agree. Radovid sent no peace envoys, nor did he advance on our positions. Instead, he trudged over the snow-bound Kestrel Mountains and attacked Kedwin, his ally. What? This attack what took the Kedweni by surprise. They were still mourning the loss of their king. Rudderless and dejected, they laid down their arms after a few lost skirmishes mm. and joined Radovid. Ah, uh, that's and why so he wanted spring, them. Instead of two resources weak and enemies, their men, we had only one powerful one. Okay. That admiration I hear in your voice? Radovid is our foe, but I cannot deny he is clever. He played us for fools, particularly dense ones at that. <laughs> Returning to the war, this spring there was a massive battle in the marshes of Velen. Massive, yet indecisive. Both sides suffered enormous losses, unprecedented even. Radovid has retreated across the Pontar. He's safe for now, until reinforcements arrive from the south. Mm. Then Emperor Emir Var Emrys will deal with him once and for all. Couldn't you just go home? Save everyone a lot of marching, not to mention a few human lives. I'm afraid the stakes are too high to fold now. We can only go all in. Right, okay. So let's get the latest from uh, Skellig. What's new in Skelliger? Oh, Skelliger. Nothing. Sorry. The islanders pride themselves on that, don't they? Doing everything according to tradition, as their forefathers did. And like their forefathers, they quarrel with each other. Pillage. Occasionally attack our transports. This is cumbersome. Hmm. But nothing more. Skelliger has always been a footnote to history, and so it shall remain. Okay. Sound awfully confident. What if King Bran manages to unite the Jarls? Lead all the clans against your fleet? King Bran is a feeble old man. From what I know, he barely remembers the names of his own vassals. Uniting all might prove difficult. Okay, I said How's then. the war going? I mean, apart from the fact that Nilfgaard's no. triumph... I our offense. I only a week. Oh, no, okay. I thought I was ratted. Right, sorry, guys. Yes. I thought so, I um selected the other one. Uh, select what that. What about Kavir? Kavir values its neutrality enough not to lend its armies, or more importantly, it's even Switzerland its to either side. Returning to the war, this spring there was a massive battle in the marshes of Velen. Massive. Mm. 
yet indecisive. Both sides suffered enormous losses, unprecedented even. Radovid has retreated across the Pontar. He's safe for now. For now. Until reinforcements arrive from the south. Then Emperor <clears throat> Amir Var Emrys will deal with him once and for all. Couldn't okay. you just go home? Save everyone. I'm right. afraid this. So, thanks, thanks for your help. For your Let's help. get going. Think nothing of it. May the great sun light your path. Cool. Oh, sorry, mate. Oh, sorry. <laughs> sorry, mate. Oh, sorry, mate. Oh, to see that. Oh, sorry. Arrgh. Oh, sorry, mate. All right, let's have a look around. What's that? Let's loot that. What is it? Letter to Yennefer. Oh, cool. So, Alexa, shut up. Stupid thing. All right, take that. Read. Yennefer. My dear friend, thank you for your letter. Forgive me for not answering you earlier. Attempt to reach me via Megascope. Megascope? What the hell's Megascope? I'm trying to limit my magic communication to the absolute minimum. One never knows who's listening. Do you agree? I am delighted you have found your position at our gracious Emperor's Court and wish you the best of luck in your search for his daughter. It is good to know that Emir in, Emir's intentions for her have become more, how shall I put it, mundane. Perhaps in these circumstances agree, an agreement regarding the lodge will prove possible after all. In response uh, to your first question, I can state beyond all doubt that Ciri has not, not appeared anywhere in the south of Yoruga. Believe me, I could recognise her magic my signature uh, magic signature in my in my sleep Blech, get your teeth in grump i have not had any contact with tris for a long time i only know that things in uh, novograd have taken an ill turn she mentioned something earlier about fleeing to kovia but i'm afraid that in the current political climate that amounts to an impossible daydream i hope i will soon be able to join you in uh, visima Visima? Yeah. First, however, I must take care of some unfortunate ur yet urgent matters in blah, 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 clear. Uh, my fondest regards, uh, Vigo. P.S. Thank you for the news about Geralt. He always seems to land on his feet, doesn't he? Yes, I do. Oh, hang on. Let's have a little read of that. So that's what she looks like. The scars healed cool. nicely. Yes, scars healed nicely. What's this? I don't want a bread knife. What's this? Uh, a sword for witches. Uh, take that. Okay, I'm not sure if I wanted that, to be honest with you. What's here? The Wild Hunt. And a subscribe button. Oh my god, I'm going to take that subscribe button. That'd be awesome. Uh, okay, what's this one? Uh, I don't think I should have taken that other book, because... Well, you know. Right. It's just useless, I think. It's carrying, weighing me down. Should we have a look at our... Uh, stuff. Tutorial characters, books, crafting, alchemy, world map, quests, character. I wonder if it's in my character one. Meditation tutorial characters so I can oh I can't look at my inventory while I'm in the castle fair enough right retrieve your equipment and then get the fuck out of dodge How let's go dude serve the gentleman by returning my things yeah bitch citrus and cloves the fragrance will keep the gentleman's robes fresh somewhat longer. Mm. Mm. Thanks, Bunches. Oh. Thanks, Bunches. The Emperor Kissy is not face. known to his patience. <laughs> he wants his daughter back safe and sound. As soon as possible. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Whatever, mate. Yeah. something of the sort. So long. The Emperor shall guide us straight to Novigrad. Oh, yeah, nice. Oh, what's this? Oh, I can't get over that. Jump. Oh, okay. 
Fuck this. Mm. Uh -huh. Oh, okay. Yeah, I, I don't want to play See you. that game. Fuck that. Uh, is that that guy there? It is that guy. I'm pretty sure I should learn how to play that game. It probably gives me something, but I think the storyline is more important, isn't it? Right, let's go and get our shit. Our fast travel. All right. Uh, hang on. What? Oh, that was the um, the guy we just saw. Okay, cool. So, let's fast travel. Uh, how do I fast travel to a different place? Oh, world map. There we go. So, where should we go? I think they said start here and the marker is here. So, I think we'll go there, guys. Uh, oh, what have we got here? We've got loads of uh, notice board, notice board. Wow, this map is huge. No wonder it's over a hundred hours long. This game. Geralt and right, let's travel. Reunited, but something even more important happened in Bezima. Geralt learned that Cirilla, his one-time ward, had returned from afar, and she was in danger. He was to find her at the Emperor's command and Yennefer's behest. Mm. Behest. Okay, it's not a forest. Poor little village. Standard stuff, really, isn't it? Hmm. Oh, okay, apart from that. Nice. Looks like a Christmas tree. Lots of decorations. Lovely. Right. Do I really need this bloody griffin's head? Thank you for purchasing hearts and you currently track quests to change. Okay. Don't know what... I'm not sure why all that came up. I don't really want this griffin's head. I wonder if I can sell it or something. Let's go! Let's go! Right. Oh, that's a... I don't want to attack a dog. I'm just going to go past them. Yes, you can't catch me. I'm on a really fast horse. Piss off. Oh, bull bulls. Come on. There we go. Jump. I wish it did an automatic jump because I'm crap Run, at roach. jumping. Come on. Let's go, Roach. I should probably be collecting these herbs. Step on. What do you fucking say? Whoa! Mm. Okay, I'll approach. Is this like a side quest? What do you want? <laughs> what do you want, you slave? Rejoice, for even a creature as depraved and base in nature as you. All right, mate. Jeez. That stung a bit. Someone must see to the corpses on the battlefield. Necrophages defile those not already rotting in mass graves. Mm. This is not right. That's to be my good deed for the day. A handsomely profitable one, I might add. Eh. I know your kind don't work for free. Who works for free? Not interested. Not interested. Farewell. You talk to me like shit. I don't do shit for you. I'm going to go back to my mission. I think what I will do for the next one, though, is I'll learn about all the herbs and stuff, because I'm pretty sure I should be, like, making potions and, uh, you know, ready for battle. And I'm not sure if I would have missed that, because I uh, turned off tutorial. Uh... Ow! Get off, bitch! Oh, yes. 
Look at that. What a hero. Shut up, you slag. Unbind me before the next ones come. When they come, I'll tend to them. <laughs> Meanwhile, let's you and me chat. Yeah. Like to know who I'm untying. <sighs> John <sighs> Verdon. Served in the 10th Maribor Division. Long way from your army. Mm. The army don't exist no more. Black one smashed it a bit. I scarped off into the woods just before that happened. Join a group of refugees. Fucking bursting with patriotism, they were. As soon as they learned I'd have been bursting, mate. Oh, you down. slag. Tied me up like a turkey, left me to the drowners. I'll untie you. Fine, I'll help. Oh, thanks. For a minute there, I was almost sure you'd leave me to die. Nah. You seem like a pretty decent I'd like bloke. To thank you somehow, but I'm not a chip crown to my name. Tough. I'll take the loss. Thanks, Witcher. May you prosper on the path. Okay. So maybe by doing these little good, good deeds, um, people start liking us a bit more. I doubt it, but you never know. Roach, where are you? Roach, oh, there you are. Sorry, dude. Right, let's Move crack it. on, guys. That's one good deed. See, that other guy, he was, he was appreciative, but... Appreciative? He appreciated what I did, but that priest was just an ass. Right, let's get on with this. Hmm. I think I need to learn how to craft as well, because not just for the, uh, the potions, but for the... Where the hell am I going? Where's the map? Oh, how did I miss that turn? Give up. Oh, I was down here, that's why. Okay. Yeah, not just for the potions, but for oh, uh, for my weapons and armor and all of that. And I probably need to fix them up a bit as well, because I think Strange the swords and stuff. Alright. Learn run for your run, lives. Run. Oh dear. Come on now. What's that? Let's have some bread. I hope feel bad about the looting. It should just say take, not loot, because I don't really want to uh, steal things off people. Let's have a chat to you, dude. Looking for a man. Goes by Hendrik. Oh, why you now, big you boy? Want to talk to him? What about? Give me a bottle of something strong. <laughs> the tiniest cup in the world. Oh, that could be him. Everyone's leaving. The bad boy returns. You gotta go. I'll open the back way for you. I ain't going nowhere, mate. I haven't finished my drink. Haven't finished my drink yet. Yeah. In Cape Vodka. Who's this in? Who's this one? Brave warrior looks like. Got two swords, see? Oi, great boy. What's the point of having two swords? Wonder if he keeps an extra prick in his trousers too. <laughs> you fucking deaf. Gonna say who you are? Or do I need to loosen your tongue with me knife? They're a bit aggressive, aren't they? Jesus, like, chill out, guys. Uh, I'm a witcher. I'm a witcher. Heard you wondering about my swords. Well, one's for monsters, the other for humans. Yeah. Only got one prick, though, in case you're wondering about that, too. Don't touch him. Mm -hmm. Don't even look at him. Worse than lepers, that lot. Saw one in action once. Killed a half dozen. Blood everywhere. Freak didn't even show a drop of sweat. Got the stench of corpses on him. <laughs> if you want to rest, come with me. Or the bench you can use. Okay, thanks, mate. I note, and there's the bumpkin with Let's go and talk like to them. You stink of dead men. Get out. Fuck off. I wonder if I can. Uh... Now, do you want if to... it's human speech you don't understand, I'll explain it with iron, you bastard. Oh, I can. Give this Oh. Okay. 
Wow. I'll take some thread. I don't want your sword. Let's loot. Oh, grilled pork. No, I don't want an axe. Crowns. Nice. Okay, so, yeah. Mistake. Mistake. Oh, that actually hurt. Dude. All that for a bit of cotton. Um, yeah, maybe I, uh... Let's talk. Sorry, mate. I didn't mean to, uh... Have you any idea what the Baron will do when he learns of this butchery? Oh, fuck. That was so cool. The village. He'll it, tear it apart before it can actually anyone can say it was some wandering mutant tunnel. Change the storyline by just doing shit like that. That's so... That is awesome. Where's Hendrik? You deaf? Understand what I'm saying? Baron won't let this stand. Yeah, I'll Calm down. cut him up. Your Baron's no idiot. Seriously doubt he'll think you locals cut his men down with farming implements. Now where's Hendrik? Man lives in Heatherton. Don't Heatherton. Know where that is. Other side of the hill. Looked that away this morning and saw a strange glow. Imperials on the raid, perhaps. Mm. But who knows? Okay. What do you know about him? Anything else you can tell me about Hendrik? Odd fellow. Arrived from who knows where and for no apparent reason. Shacked up with a widow whose husband was stabbed for a scrap wow. of bread. Baron's men don't like strangers. Aye. Aye. Stay out of their way. Oi, they don't. Always no, they know don't, boy. Coming. Always manages to disappear. Right then. Thanks, Inkeep. Go out the back. Go out the back. the Baron's men in the village. No need to worry about me. <laughs> I'm going to go through the front and just... Any more trouble All right, okay. For us both. All right, I'll go through the back. Where's the back? Well, there is no back. I'm going out the front. Um, well, guys, I think I'm going to leave it there for now because we've done a bit. You know, storylines progressed. And next time we'll go and talk to this dude and see what happens. Now we've cut up all these guys, which have magically disappeared. I wonder if that it really does impact the storyline. Um, so, yeah, if you did enjoy that, please do subscribe or smash the like button. And I'll see you guys in the next video. So, goodbye for now.